Kevin with Brand Law Firm, and I'm here to tell you three ways that you can beat a marijuana less than one ounce charge. Unlike other parts of the world, marijuana possession in Georgia is a very serious offense in terms of the consequences that it can have for you and your license. A conviction for mere possession of marijuana can result in your license being suspended with very little hope for getting a work permit. It's very important that you do everything you can to avoid the conviction for the marijuana possession. This video will explain the most common one that we get, which is marijuana possession less than one ounce. The first thing that you should do is investigate your case and file motions. I invite you to look at my video on what you should do if you have an arraignment coming up. This includes investigating your case and filing motions. You cannot approach the solicitor or the prosecutor in your case unless you know what kind of leverage you're working with. A second powerful way to beat your marijuana charge is by in engaging in a program called pretrial diversion. You and the state have a contract. You and the state agree that they will divert your case away. You will fulfill your end of the bargain, which usually involves community service, drug and alcohol evaluation, and things of that nature. And their end of the bargain is your case gets dismissed. Most jurisdictions will not accept you into the program unless you have an attorney. You must have little to no criminal history in order to be a part of this program. So this is very good for young people who made a mistake, made a one-time mistake, and want to get out of this without having to suffer the consequences of a conviction. A third powerful way to beat your marijuana charge is what's called a first offender discharge, a first offender plea. There's a statute specifically for marijuana Let's just assume that you do not qualify for the pretrial diversion program because you have some criminal history or because you flunked out of the pretrial diversion program. Then this is a powerful alternative for you to avoid a conviction on a marijuana possession charge. You plead guilty, but the judge will not actually enter your guilty plea. He will withhold the adjudication of your guilt until you complete your end of the bargain, which is you go out and you do community service or whatever other terms the court imposes. At the end of that, your case will be discharged and you will be exonerated without an adjudication of guilt. So that's three ways that you can avoid a conviction on your marijuana charge. Please contact Crown Law Firm. We know what we're doing and we'd be happy to discuss your charges.